Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Look, I got a whole pile, a whole pile of stuff. So my bestie Lisa in Texas, um, and I ordered some stuff from my party. I will tell you though, if it's actually, yeah. You might be seeing this after my party. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Because I'm trying to think if, like, I want to surprise them the best I can, which is going to be hard because, you know, but kind of like back and forth. Do I share with them? Do I not share with them? All the things. Oh. So she did tell me what everything was so I can explain it to you a little bit. So this is... A, let me try to open it. This is a Harry Potter photo booth. Sorry. Apparently it's Fort Knox. I didn't realize Fort Knox delivered for Amazon or packaged for Amazon. Okay, so it's a photo booth costume. I'm going to take all the stickers out. So I guess you make them yourself because there's all of these there's all of these stickers for you to put together your own thing. So hold on one second. And there are these as well. Oh, how great. And then the sticks. Okay. So we have wands, and we have, oh, the actual frames. That's cute. Oh, that's really cute. There's so many pieces. I wonder if she knew. <gasps> Hedwig. Oh, I'm so not using this for my party. I am just gonna keep these. Oh my gosh, she could be Dobby. I don't want to punch Dobby's eyes out, but I have to. Oh my gosh, so cute. She is so sweet. There is a huge package. Now that I have the stickers out, you guys can see. Look at this huge package. Oh my goodness. Thanks, Ma. Glasses of all kinds. They look like Professor McGonagall glasses. They're, of course, Harry Potter glasses. There's different frames. There's. I am so excited. Oh my God, I can't wait to tell her I got it. She was, she got yelled at because I said, you're not supposed to do that. She's like, I just had to though. <laughs> oh, how wonderful. Oh, I'm excited. Let me stick this in the back. It'll stay nice and flat. So I'm going to have to try to juggle it in. So this one happens to be stuck. There we go. <laughs> yes. So apparently it comes with glue dots, which are coming off of all of this. And these big glue dots, which I'm not really sure. It doesn't seem to be instructions, but I will look on the website. Because sometimes on Amazon, where like person has an individual store that they sell from, they do that. They tell you like the instructions on the website. So I will do, and here's a glue dot, which is, don't you drop that. <laughs> a glue dot that's going to make it absolutely impossible to put away. Okay, it's stuck to the, the sticks, the sticks are stuck on a glue dot, so that's funny. And glue dots and all the things. And so now this is a project. I can't wait. I should make her do it. I should like when she comes here and be like, all right, smarty pants. Now you have to put it together. <laughs> so here's another box. She 
She said there's more stuff coming on Monday, so you might see this haul in parts. <laughs> Actually, you will see this haul in parts. <laughs> I'm so excited. So she said, I'm sending you a gift bag. So just put it aside for me for when I get there. Okay, here's your gift bag. Look how cute that is. I'm excited to get that gift bag back. But this is it. This is it. She found headbands, Harry Potter version. What? 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 I'm so excited. Did you guys ever play headbands? So we used to call it Indian poker and, and not to be politically incorrect or whatever, but I don't know why they called it that. Um, and you used to hold the card, like you'd take a deck of 52 cards and you would hold the card here that only the people around you could see it. And then you would try to like say, who has the highest card, try to get people to go out thinking they have the lowest card. So it's a lot of game of bluff, but this is sort of that concept where you have the card here and the people around you have to try to get you to, des to, to describe to you what your card is so you can guess what your card is. But Harry Potter version. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Yeah. This is something very little in there. <laughs> So let's see what that is. Now it's supposed to have like a pull tab, but I don't see. <sighs> Temporary tattoos. Now, this is fantastic, don't get me wrong. I'm, it's, I'm so excited about this because of Harry Potter and Harry Potter tattoos. But here's what I wanted to share with you. When I worked at the nursery school, they did parties on the weekends. I don't know if I have ever told you that. I kind of feel like I mentioned the hair thing once. A half of the nursery school was, it was attached to a hair salon for kids. Um, and the nursery school was on one side, the hair salon was on the other side. And only joined them, they, they had a connecting door that was like never opened during the day. And then a receptionist who was Grandma Jane. She wasn't a receptionist, but that was really her, her title, office manager really. Um, anyway, short story long, um, we did parties on the weekends. So one of the things that we always put in party bags was temporary tattoos. We would get sheets, uh, sometimes they were cut up, sometimes we had to cut them up. And I'm so excited because that's what this reminds me of. I'm reminding of like, I finally get to have a calling all kids birthday party. If you're from Long Beach, Island Park, Oceanside, Long Island, you know what I'm talking about. And then this. is from 11 times six. This is also from Lisa for the party. She's such a goof. She found not just Harry Potter socks. They are these, I, I never remember the name of them. They're like these cute, like Funko Pop vinyl kind of head. I don't know that they're cool. Oh my gosh. So there's Harry and Dobby and Ron, Juan Juan. Oh, you can't really see. Let me put my hand in each one of them. Let me start over. Try putting my hand in each one. Here is Harry with Hedwig. You can see him a little bit. Here is Dobby. He's a house elf who gets a sock and makes him free. <laughs> 
here is Ron. Juan Juan. Lavender calls him. My Juan Juan. Here is Harry again, flying his broomstick on a gray background sock, which I love. Here is Hermione, and Hermione's sock is orange and red stripes, which I think is awesome. <laughs> and finally, Hedwig, all by herself, on a blue sock. My Ravenclaw might get the Hedwig one. I'm just saying. I don't know for sure. I haven't decided. <laughs> we'll see. So thank you, Mama. Um, so that's that's it from now. From Lisa. I thought my things were coming today too, but that's it for what Lisa sent me for today. Um, so when we were in Five Below, I found the individual Birdie Bots flavored beans. They were each $2 for a little tiny box of beans. So if you don't know Harry Potter, let me just give you a tiny bit of background. Um, obviously it's supposed to be a magical world. It's fantasy, you know, they're called witches and wizards, but it's fantasy, it's not Wiccan, just so you know. Um, though they may have some, but no, really, it's really just fantasy, but Birdie Bot's Every Flavor Beans, or imagine Jelly Bellies, but some of the flavors could taste like earwax or vomit. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I know that that sounds gross, but they're supposed to be like, uh, not a gag gift necessarily, but you know, because of magic. So when I was there, I, one of, gosh, I feel like, I wanna say it was somebody on YouTube, but it might've been somebody on Instagram. They showed me that if you download the Amazon app, you can scan a UPC code while you're shopping and see if you can get a better price on Amazon. Well, that's what I did. These were $2 a piece and I was willing to pay $2 a piece for my sisters and friends, that's fine. But I was like, let me see if Amazon has a better deal. Well, Amazon did a much better deal. I got a box of 24 of them and I believe, I'm gonna put the price here, but I believe they were a dollar a box or just around a dollar a box. So I think I got 24 for $25. One of the things that I bought was $25. The other one, the other one was more, but I will put right here what it costs. But either way, there was, you know, there was, it was not $48, let's put it that way. And I like this better because in the movie, the box that has the beans in it is a little bit bigger. And um, uh, I wanna say it was, it was Anne. Yeah, Anne, I'm sorry. Anne sent me, um, yeah, I think it was Anne. She sent me a printable of a box on, that I can print out on cardstock and actually make the box, but the box is bigger. So like these are teeny tiny boxes, as you can see, each one of those is just one, it's about that big. So I was thinking, oh, these are better because I'll have four boxes per person um, or three boxes per person if Jim wants one, but I really can't eat them because they're regular jelly beans. Um, so this would fill up the birdie bots box better so i got these as well these came yesterday but i just knew that um more stuff was coming so i would share it with you but um i do have more stuff coming so i'm gonna say goodbye right now but i'm sure you guys i'm sure you guys will see another ending when more stuff comes monday tomorrow whatever um yeah lisa said her stuff was the rest of the stuff was gonna come monday i thought my stuff was coming today so maybe it's gonna come tomorrow because they do deliver on saturday so i'm not worried about that all right that's it everybody i love you thank god for everything that he has given me all of my blessings i'm so excited for my birthday and if you guys have any questions go ahead and leave them in the comments and share and all the things whatever is still available by the time i post this video i will go ahead and link in the description box down below they're not affiliate links we don't get any credit for them but it's just a helpful resource for you guys to find what you're looking for and as always, you guys take care. God bless. Until next time. Bye. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. I'm sorry about my gross lip. And I'm sorry about the way that I sound. I am battling my biannual sinus infection. I know. I tried. I think just being away 
over the weekend being in the country and stuff i know traveling in general but i try I always wore my mask and i always washed my hands but it happens it happens i got a package from the rocket man So sometimes you buy stuff and you buy stuff from like, say you buy stuff from like James Henson Incorporated. Well, James Henson Incorporated might have been sold under, you know, Jerry Ann brands. And, you know, when they ship it, they ship it from James Henson Incorporated. You're like, I don't know what that is. But, ah, I think I just told Lisa about this hack. So you could put like a box inside the envelope. And you only get charged the flat rate envelope price. I know what it is. I know what it is. This is my Harry Potter gummy slugs. If you have seen, um, sorry, that is my nose. If you have seen Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets, Ron broke his wand and went to go tell Malfoy to eat slugs and ended up cursing himself and spit out all the slugs. So that's what they are, gummy slugs. These are from my party. You probably won't see this until after my party, but I don't know how I'm going to post stuff. I'm going to check the dates, make sure they're all still good. Oh, November 2021, we're good. So I got these from Amazon. Thank you. If you're my Amazon seller, rocket me. Um, and thank you, Amazon. So since that's from Amazon, I'll open this other Amazon package. Um, this, I don't know what this is. <laughs> oh, I dropped my scissor. So... Jane, she surprised me. Aw, she's so sweet. I did. I wish she could be here for my party. <laughs> There's like five little cards that say enjoy your gift from Sarah Jane. Oh my goodness. Thank you. Is it a shocker? <laughs> so this is LED lights. Um. Hey baby, are you busy? Nope. Would you come Help me, this is yeah. a big box. Uh-oh, what? Uh -oh. what happened? It's Sarah Jane sent me this, I didn't expect it, I'm sorry. I got caught off guard, can you maybe sit and hold the box for me? Sure. So we bought when we were up by below. I wanted to remember. Oh, okay. Okay. No, I don't remember, but okay. 
So she sent me a box. She sent me a box of 12 LED candle lights. Oh, okay. So in Harry Potter in Hogwarts, they have floating candles. And I made a I made a craft you guys haven't seen yet because I wanted to share it all after my party. But um they're battery operated. So I gotta get a lot of batteries. Thank you. So you just hang them from fishing line. And I'll show you guys the hack that I came up with to to hang them with some, no muss, no fuss. Oh. I was gonna make this. <laughs> this is, there's a thank you card in there. I guess from the person who created it. I guess. There's a thank you card in there. And it's, there we go. Let's see if I can't. Okay, there. Oh yes, it says. <laughs> Thank you for, as a growing com a thank you for your purchase. As a growing company, your review goes a long way. So I so totally will. And it's a giant, um, if you watch just the stuff I got from Lisa, um, there's a little one of these in there that, that's um, like, it's a take your pictures in it. So thank if you. you're, thank you. Thank you, Jim, I'm sorry. Um, if you have not seen the movies, <laughs> if you have not seen the movies, there is a prison and it's the prison. Okay. Just making sure that's not my food. Um, if you haven't seen the movie, there's a prison called Azkaban where they send all the wit the the witches and wizards who've done bad things. And this is like the wanted poster. And the other thing, if you've never seen Harry Potter, the pictures move, or some of the pictures move. Um, so this would actually be really cute if you took like a boomerang of like, you know, you can be like that. Ah. So it's really cute, it's really nice. And it says approach with extreme caution. Do not attempt to use magic against this wizard. Any information leading to the arrest of this wizard shall be duly rewarded. Notify immediately by Owl to the Ministry of Magic. I'm so excited. Jimmy said there's more. What is this? The wall hanging like back down. Can you just ruin it for me? Yeah. You asked. Not you. I didn't ask you. <laughs> so there's a sign that says platform nine and three quarters. And then, oh my God. So I no longer have to do this DIY because she sent me the brick wall. Oh my goodness. Nice quality. Yeah, I can fill it through the plastic. Yeah. They would give you re reusable as kind of bracelets. Yeah, it's like, like canvas. Right, exactly. I was just gonna say it's like a treated canvas. <gasps> oh my goodness. And it's split down the middle. So again, if you've never seen the movie, this is totally bizarre to you, but to enter into the magical world from the muggle world, aka the real world. Um there's certain areas that you certain ways to get in there and one of them is to go through the leaky cauldron which is a like a bar pub i guess because it's england right and to tap on the bricks and then the bricks open so that is this but also when you get onto platform nine and three quarters so that's there's two so <laughs> they do it twice let's put it this way one is the bricks open to get into Diagon Alley. And then when you go to go to Hogwarts, 
It's at King's Cross Station, which is a real station in England. But the ticket says, did I give you back the sign? So the ticket says, go to platform nine and three quarters. And even Harry asks the guy at the train station, he's like, platform nine and three quarters, what are you like losing your mind? So what this is, is you have to walk directly at the wall between platforms nine and 10. And the, you just dissolve through the bricks when nobody's looking, because of course magic. So this is a brick wall that you can go through. So they could be platform nine and three quarters, but it could also be, if, you, if you're ever purchasing this, you, it could also be um, to get into Diagon Alley from the Leaky Cauldron, which I think is so awesome. I'm just gonna cry and I'm gonna call her in a few minutes and I'm gonna cry on the phone to her about how she needs to come to my birthday party and we'll figure out a place to put her. You fold it, just hold it for me. Don't have to fold it, just hold it. I just don't wanna take up all the time. I don't wanna take up all the time. Um, oh my God, Sharon is gonna wanna steal this from me. Sharon, you cannot have it. Maybe I'll be nice to you, I don't know. Oh my gosh. <gasps> What in heaven's name? O-M-G. Oh, oh, look, that's not my new wall hanging for my office. Right behind your videos. A library. It's got books. And it's this really great piece of fabric. Oh my gosh, I love it. Oh, it's got a broomstick stand in the corner. Oh. I love it. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. So sweet. I don't even, I don't even know how to say thank you. I love it. Thank you so much. Yeah. So, those are, those are all my Amazon birthday surprises, apparently. Um, sorry. <laughs> I know, open boxes and then touch my face, but I don't care, I'm crying, that's what I gotta do. Um, look away. If you guys have any questions at all, go ahead and leave them in the comments down below. Sorry, Jay, I love you. I wish I felt better for this because I'm gonna do her justice that I don't look like this and sound like this, so. She don't care, I don't mean that, I just, I don't. I don't know what I'm saying. If you guys have any questions at all, leave them in the comments down below. And don't forget to share this video with friends and family. Anybody you know who might be throwing together a Harry Potter party of one form or another, or is just a big fan and wants to have decor in their room. And if you haven't yet, click subscribe. When you do, a little bell will pop up. When you ring that bell, YouTube will let you know whenever I upload a new video. Don't I have like the best friends ever? Look, Hedwig approves. And as always, you guys, take care. God bless. I'll see you next time. Love you guys. Bye.